Hey YouTube, today's video is going to be a review of my US M17 gas masks. Um, starting off, I'll start with the M17A1, which is this mask right here. Um, mine was produced by MSA in 1969, 1969. and um, the M17A1 gas mask was produced from around the late 60s up until the early 80s so these masks did see use in the Vietnam War the M17A1 was produced so it could replace um, the, the ABC M17 field protective mask this mask has a drinking tube system with a voice diaphragm the mask uses triangular glass eye lenses which allows the user to have a great field of view this mask has a six point head strap design, which is pretty comfortable when you're wearing it. Now, um, I'm gonna talk about the M17A2. The main differences between them is that this one does not have the resuscitation feature uh, um, built into the mask. They both have drinking tubes, but in the inside of the A1, if you can see there, Here's your, here's your drinking tube part, but this big piece right here is the resuscitation tube, and um, it was a failed design, and there's studies that um, confirm that certain chemicals and gases and stuff like that can breach through the mask because of that resuscitation tube, so this is pretty much an outdated mask, and this is the the M17 you would want if you were trying to get it for I don't know a prepping point of view or something like that or you just collecting this one's or you're reenacting the Vietnam War this one's much better to wear it's more comfortable the resuscitation tube doesn't always go into your mouth although the drinking tube will on both of them that won't matter and then the second differences between the two are the lever for the drinking tube this is how this one looks on this mask. Um, this is how it looks on this mask. So yeah, the lever on the mask looks a bit different. Um, one's a little like bulkier in design, but that's about it. Um, both these masks were used up until the 90s when the M40 field protective mask was developed and put into service. Um, the bags that they come with um, are pretty much identical in design except for like the US logos and this one says M17A2 medium um, or should yeah medium and then this one says US mass protective field m17 medium so they're the same material and the strap design that's on them allows it to be worn by the hip which is more comfortable than having it around your neck so yeah but that's about it for this video i just wanted to do a quick review on the m17 um, these are my M17 gas masks. They do come with accessories. Unfortunately, mine didn't come with the accessories. I got a, a pretty good deal on these because it didn't have them. So, yeah, thank you guys for watching the video. And have a good day. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more gas mask videos and stuff about prepping and survival. So, thanks a lot and have a good day.